Stop. Do not move. Stuff. Do not move stuff. I'll explain why. And now, if you're just starting your cleanup operation, decluttering, organizing, purging, it may be tempting to uh, get into the action, to show some movement, to show some progress, to get into the sorting, to free up some visible space, to move things around. But I suggest uh, exercising some caution uh, at this stage because the thing is it's very easy to make things worse. Now I'm going to say something that uh, will perhaps be seen as um, highly debatable uh, by some parties such as uh, a concerned uh, significant other or relatives and it's this you already have an organization system your stuff is already organized in a way and you know what it's a pretty damn good organization system you are pretty well organized you know why the things you use regularly, the things you use daily, you're able to find them, right? Other stuff, even stuff that you don't use, you probably know at least approximately where uh, things are, uh, what is stored where, why those things are there, and uh, generally you have some at least some rough idea where everything is and where everything should be or at least supposed to be. Now with some hasty moves it's very easy to do much much worse than that. Uh, just hypothetically if uh, if you were to take all, all of your existing stuff such as it is and totally scramble it, totally reshuffle it to just rearrange, reorder in some random order. Uh, whether that's that's done by you or someone else. Or for example, if you're moving, uh, how, how often have you experienced this, if you experienced any moves uh, recently, that after a move, unless you're very, very careful, it's very easy to end up with a situation where you cannot find anything. It's that same principle. I would recommend before you move things, uh, have a plan, have a, have a method. What are you moving? Why are you moving it? And uh, what's the overall sequence? What's the overall plan? What area are you cleaning up uh, so that you're making improvements? You're not making things worse. Um, you're able to find things as it is, for better or for worse, at least those things you use daily. That's because regardless of how messy the situation is, uh, regardless of, of, of what you keep uh, and how you keep it, you have some rough idea. You rely on your memory and uh, uh, habits to find and put things away that you use with any regularity and you have some rough idea um, about the rest. So instead of losing all, all of that advantage, I suggest uh, keeping it, at least for now, until you're uh, specifically dealing with particular uh, items and containers, I suggest leaving them right where they are until it's their turn to be processed or at least if you're moving something if you're reorganizing on the spot ad hoc at least have some rough plan have some rough idea uh, that uh, uh, why you're moving things where you're moving them to 
and how this is all serving to make things better, at least not make things worse. The goal is to be generally making improvements. So keep the, the parts of your organization system that work for now and um, instead have a plan, have a method and uh, tackle uh, bad clutter, tackle specific areas that you're working on one by one.